Hello everyone, what's going on? I'm Thundershot, and welcome to the Banjo Kazooie Extras video. That's right, just when you thought we were done, I briefly mentioned it at the very end of the video, but to elaborate a little bit more, this is an extras video showing off all the extra stuff you can do in Banjo Kazooie that I didn't exactly cover. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, that being really only one thing. <coughs> Sorry, I got something in my throat. That being really only one thing, and that thing being that uh, there is a mini game here, and this mini game unlocks other cheats you can type in the game. They don't actually help you in the game necessarily, but they are kind of funny. So we're going to go check that out now. Not from the very beginning of the game. It can be addressed at the very beginning of the game. But from treasure, from the point you unlock Treasure Trove Cove and onward, you can come in here and play a Bottles the Mole mini game with Jiggies. All you got to do is stand on the carpet, look at first person mode, and look at Bottles. And he will pop up and tell you about the puzzle game. And bottom line, he says you win a mystery prize. But it's just some cheats. Or maybe, now watch this. So, the whole point of the thing is it's going to mix up a puzzle for you. And you got to solve it. Use the left stick to move Banjo's hand. Press A to pick it up and put it down. Press X to return them to the side or to the or the right stick. Now, if you played Banjo-Tooie, I didn't elaborate on that very well, but if you played Banjo-Tooie, this is actually how you unlock new worlds in Banjo-Tooie. You still have to look for Jiggies, and you still have to have Jiggies. However, there we go. Um... However, you don't just punch him in like we did through all the way through Banjo Kazooie. You don't just show up and put him in and then have that be the end of it. Uh, you actually do this. You rebuild him like a puzzle piece. Now, this first bottles level is very easy. It's just showing you how it is, and every single piece on the outside is exactly where it needs to be. So, what's going to happen from here on out is I'm probably going to quit talking because it's really hard to talk and do this at the same time, even something this simple. Oops. So instead what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you until the end when I beat it. And then he'll tell me the bottles bonus thing. And yeah, there's up to like, I don't know, I think there's six total of these mini games, And they get extremely hard by the end. And yeah. We'll see what he tells us. Hey, you did it. It was easy, Beetle Breath. What do we win? Listen carefully and I'll tell you. Use the tiles on the floor in the sand castle and treasure trove cove to spell the word bottles bonus one. Now that keeps going into bottles bonus two. I think it goes all the way to five. And then six is something kind of special. You can also try level two of my game if you like. Just look at the picture. Again. So yeah, you can just keep doing that over and over again. And you can get all the way to six. And this, these things do stuff like give Banjo big hands, big feet, um, make Kazooie's head big. I'm going to keep doing these, I'm going to keep working on these, and you'll see when I get to the end of them. Uh, I'll show you that, and then I'll tell me bottles bonus too and all that crap. But yeah, see you guys in a second. Okay, so there you have it. Level 2 is finished. Level 2 is... <clears throat> almost as easy as level, almost as easy as, eh, almost as easy as level one. You shouldn't have any trouble with it. Um, bottles bonus two is what you enter. But here's the thing: these things start getting a lot harder. And by a lot harder, I mean a freaking lot harder. Like six is, I won't say damn near impossible, but you get to the point to where it mixes them up uh, really well. And also, you have to start rotating pieces. I think with the triggers, but I can't, I can't remember. And that's when it starts to suck. But I'm gonna keep trekking. Um, if I give up, you can look up someone. Someone else has got a video on it. We'll see where this goes. There you go, three was a bit of a close call, but we got it done. You did have to rotate puzzle pieces in three, and that's when it kind of gets hard. So I tell you what, I'm going to wrap it up here to keep myself from shooting myself in the head. I haven't lost one yet, but I've tried this before, and I do start to lose them after that. If you want to look up anything else, I will leave you a link in the video description where you could find someone who's done all these. And also entered all the cheats. I'm not going to go into the cheats for you either because it's uh, tedious and annoying. But there are videos out there. I just wanted to show you guys that this was a thing in case you didn't know. So, yeah. Um, this may or may not be the final Banjo-Kazooie episode, depending on how well it was received. I'm not <clears throat> going to start Tui without telling you guys or anything. But there might be one more uh, little extra video that will help you guys decide um, if you get a special video or not. So, keep an eye out for that. But finally, I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm Thundershot. Uh, leave a like if you like the video, and I'm out.
Peace, guys.